Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. It's Lady Sarah. Thank you so much for being here. You caught me at a good time. I was about to head off to the Bridgerton Ball yet again this evening. I want to show you my new ball gown. I just received. I just love this. So let me go ahead and stand up and show you really quickly. It goes all the way to the floor and I love the gold details. It's got like floral in, you know, embroidered in there. It has a sash right here. Love the satin sash and the little lace details here. Super fun, super um, exciting to wear to the Bridgerton Ball. Queen Charlotte, Queen Charlotte is picking her diamond of the season this evening at the ball, so I need to get going very soon. But I do wanna show you what I picked up at Bath & Body Works, my dear friends. So if you're new to my channel, I would love if you would subscribe. My returning family, a huge thank you so much for being here. Wow, okay, so today was a huge day at Bath & Body Works, as you all know. And this video will probably go up tomorrow because it is in the evening here and I am heading off to the ball right after this video. But the, there is so much new at Bath & Body Works in general that like my video is, <laughs> I think it was like 45 minutes or something, uh, but that is chopping it down, okay? So <laughs> I went and edited the video. There, The video was very long in store and I was probably there for two hours at least, probably two hours. And whenever there's a new floor set, I always joke that I should you know pack a lunch because I really am there for a very long period of time <laughs> because I love to show everything in detail. That is something that I, feel is very important when I am doing a walkthrough video because, um, you know, online is a great tool to see what there is and to, uh, you know, of course, order. I order all the time from, well, not all the time, but a lot from online. And, but in store, it's 3D. So I love to show, I get a, I get joy out of showing you everything in 3D. So now, um, there is a part two to that video. So <laughs> I'm gonna try to post it tomorrow as well. Not sure if I'll have time going to the Bridgerton Ball this evening after all. But I did wanna go over the rest of the store walkthrough that I did showing the Brightest Bloom floor set and all of the other new items that happened while I was on vacation, okay? So please stay tuned for that video. I really wanna show you and kinda give you my impressions of everything there. I mean, I literally was in the store going, like this oh my gosh that's new that's new that's new that's new that's new oh that's new that's new I mean I literally I don't think I've ever seen that many things new all at once except for like gosh I mean it's it's seldom where it's like I was literally my head was a spin I was like oh I almost forgot that I almost forgot that. I mean in every corner of the store there's something new basically so anyways all right enough chit chat the tone is waiting for my haul I know okay another thing I want to mention is the candle holder. There is the three wick candle holder that matches this very, very well. And um, so here is the single wick one. I did not pick up the three wick candle holder yet in the crown. The three wick candle holder is $24.95. This one is $16.95. And of course, this one is not available anymore on the you know at Bath and Body Works but I feel like I wish they would have brought this one back with this collection because I think this is so pretty and I think it would have been really nice to have for those who didn't get the single wick one to match to have a three wick and the single wick so I plan to probably get it um I'm kind of doing like all the cart you know I'm at Bath and Body Works a lot so um you know I especially I'm hearing a uh, sell I'm hearing on social media that there might be a sell Wednesday on candles like a few days like starts Wednesday it goes a few days so that's a time when I can pick it up too or order online but I do think I should get the three wick crown since I have the single wick but I'm glad I have the single wick again $16.95 and the only other thing is I wish it didn't have a snowflake in it uh, for the Bridgerton collection. I think it would have been better if there was like a B maybe in there or just another more gemstones that go around there. So anyways, there's that. And then, I mean, this is gonna be a long haul, my friends. So, um, because there's a lot of things I wanna touch on. Like, you know, there's a lot of things about this collection. So we have, well, this is something I was hoping Bath & Body Works would bring. This is not Bath & Body Works, uh, but this is a chandelier candle holder. I ended up buying this years ago at Goodwill, and I think I paid like under $6 for it. But do you see the, the chandelier jewels just dripping off this candle holder? I have always loved this so much, and so I thought it would have been so nice if Bath & Body Works you know, gave us an actual 
like pedestal candle holder. I know we have the crown one, which I'm thankful for, but I would have loved if we had something along the lines of this, especially that we have the chandelier um, wallflower plug, which is stunning. It is so pretty. I also show that in my walkthrough video. It's like across the room, I could see it lit up. It was so bright. So in the video, my walkthrough video, it is against a black wall, so it's harder to see how bright it is, but on off camera when I'm far away from it, it was really bright. So I do want to mention that. Okay, and I know a lot of you are wishing for or hoping that we would get a candle like candelabra, like a candelabra type candle holder as well. And then I have diamond of the season right here on top of these pedestals, which of course are available at Bath and Body Works. So pretty. I think this really is a nice pair. I think this pairs really well together. Okay. So let's move on with the haul. I'm actually going to get into the nitty gritty of this haul. There's so many fun things to show you. So let's go ahead and start that. Okay, so let me show you my bag. Okay, this bag is huge. Yes, it's huge. I uh, had some fun. I really had some fun. The only thing I wasn't able to get on my wish list was the B pocket back holder with the B on it, like the B with the B on it. <laughs> so um, that'll be, you know, I'm sure I'll find that. Hopefully I'll find that. Um, I want to start with this, this goodie right here. Now, I wasn't sure if I was going to get it. I really wasn't sure. So I saw it online and I was like, it's beautiful. Uh, but I feel like I have stuff like that kind of around here. And, uh, but when I saw it in store, I totally changed my mind. I, I think this is one of the things that's going to sell really quick. Um, this one. So the store was really sweet to give me the box and it, it, so I can store it in this when I'm done displaying it and I love that. So when you order online, friends, it should come like this. I would imagine it would come packaged just like this. I saw a few of these in store in individual boxes like this. So this is probably how it's gonna be, you know, and I always like to see how things are delivered online. <laughs> so hopefully they do come in this type of packaging. So let me go ahead and open it. I am so excited. So yes, I got the vanity, the very regal mirrored vanity. It's beautiful. And I'm going to put it in my background because I think it's going to be so pretty reflecting light. And it's just, it, it's like, I feel like it should be on the set of Bridgerton. You know, it's a smaller scale, obviously, but I feel like it's something that would have been on the set or would have, you know, been around that era, like on the vanity. So, so let me show you how it looks like this. Now, I will tell you how much everything came to at the end. I had a 25% off, which was really great. And uh, another thing is I wish is that there were body care in this collection because my goodness gracious, it is, it's amazing. Like the scents are absolutely amazing. So again, here is how it came like this in between two styrofoam pieces. And you open it up and here it is. So it's gonna be like a little cookie cutter spot for it to slide into. And I mean, they did wrap these with like TLC. They did because uh, there's actually even uh, plastic on the mirror itself. So that's really nice. So here, let me show you. Okay, so it's in the plastic. And let me take it out of here. Okay, so I want to show you the Bridgerton mirror. Oh my goodness. So it has two sides to it. It has a closer view and a further back view, like, you know, a regular swivel mirror does, like a zoomed in view. And I love that it has the tray. So this is kind of like a two in one. You get your mirror, your tray, and it's super ornate. Now it's not very big. You can see this up my hand in comparison. It's not very big. And I don't even think on video it's going to show how small it is it's not very big so here is the bridgerton lotion in in comparison okay so it's not very big um but what i think happens is because it's so ornate it gives it this bigger look to to it now don't mind the mess this this um my mirror is showing um i have all my bath and body works products right here some of them some of them but again this is they they wrapped it with this like plastic wrap right here for like protection when it was shipped and the, there's medallions going around it with like it's like a gemstone type look to it with like a not a, okay so it goes like it looks kind of like a rhinestone and then like a gold and then a rhinestone of gold and there's like a bunch of different like patterns there's like two patterns around like the fence of it I would call it and this like filigree towards the top so it's very very beautiful I love it absolutely love it and I think it's just is uh, uh, as 
the person who loves me, I love Bridgerton. I feel like this is one of those pieces that, this is one of those pieces that I would feel sad if I had missed out on. I, because I love the accessory part. I love that Bath and Body Works has accessories for the home. And this is a, definitely a decor piece. And I, I'm totally there for that. Like I love decor, decorating my house. And so the fact that they brought this in and it's actually useful. I could use it like to put makeup on if I wanted. Um, and it's just beautiful. So it looks like something in Queen Charlotte's, you know, palace. So anyways, there is the, this. Now it is $34.95 and it does have the felt kind of like bottom to it and it also has it also has the Bridgerton you know uh, tag there on it like little hang tag that is what I want to show you I had to have it I again was on the fence if I was going to get it or not but I went ahead and got it I was like because I just don't know if this one's going to sell out so I had to make sure I got it so yeah actually I'm going to take the the little plastic wrap off of it and we're going to show you I'm going to show you it swiveling let's make it swivel let's see if I can even do this let's see it's very tightly on there okay we got that okay so there it is so see it has a really nice way to you know go about swiveling it I mean however you want to position it like that like that like whatever it is so nice it is so nice so anyway there is that okay moving on and I actually got something from the wedding collection as well and yes, so I did get the Bridgerton Study Foaming Hand Soap. I didn't want to wait for a sale. I, I, I really wanted to review this with you guys. I love these scents, every single one of them. Like it, it all across the board, they're really, really nice. So we have Bridgerton Study, which is smooth amber. It says also we've got Oakwood and dry or Orchids, orchids. I can never say that word. So this is $8.95 and it's five. I think it's five for 27. And then I had a 25% off coupon. So it came down to like $4 and something for each one. But I do want to go over the scent because it smells really, really beautiful. Um, and so, and I love that it's Bridgerton study. I have to say, you know, this is meant to smell like a book, like books in the study. And, um, it comes across more so than the book loft candle. The book loft candle didn't come across as a, as um, pages in a book. So, oh my gosh, this is so good. Okay, this is very clean. And like I mentioned in my walkthrough video, it has kind of like a Vicks vapor rub little bit to it, like a little bit. I love it. It's so, it has a very manly masculine scent to it. Um, kind of like a, it has like a kick to it. And I think that's like the, uh, let's see what it's, yeah, it's so, pr it's a pretty masculine scent. I don't know how else to say it. Um, but again, a little bit of Vicks Vapor Rub, which I like this cause it gives it that kick to it. It, it's so good. Like I have to have this in the candle. So I hope that helps. Uh, Oakwood, Smooth Amber and Orchids. So, you know, anyways, I, let me smell it again. It smells so good. Yeah, and it's strong. It's strong. It's like, it reminds me of like a very, I don't know, it's like, it reminds me of a man, like a very, it's a very masculine scent. It's very masculine and I love it. So anyways, so again, I do kind of pick up that, I mean, I don't know if I'm looking for it because it says Bridgerton study and I want to smell like a study. I want to, I want it to be exactly like a study would smell like the old books and stuff like that. But um, I feel like it's a little bit in there. So I love that about it. And this is, I think, a really nice one. Next up, I got the Danbury shortbread. Oh my goodness, the Danbury shortbread, whipped vanilla, almonds, and sugared crystals. This is also, like I mentioned in my walkthrough, it's like almond, if it's it's like if almond croissant and wildberry jam donut had a baby, it would be this one, Danbury shortbread. It is so gourmand, so amazing. And we have the little, little like cake, three-tiered cake on the front and the little medallion there. It's so nice. And the back says Bridgerton right there. It is so pretty with the gold detailing on the front. Let me smell it again. I love this like burgundy. So pretty. Oh my gosh. It's so, it's like creamy. Oh my gosh. It is like cake batter. It is like, 
Mm, so, so good. So, yeah, and I, I just love the smell of, of gourmand scents. They're very comforting to me. So I did get two of them, <laughs> so I got two. And because I'm really enjoying this collection. So there we have those. Then I also picked up the Wisteria Garden. Now this is going to be Sweet Rosewood, English Rain, and Lemon Petals. So for me, this one smells like Biola Shampoo and a little bit of like lavender or, you know, I, I'm just trying to pinpoint this because it says Wisteria Garden. So I don't know if it's smelling like wisteria, exactly like wisteria, but let me smell it again, renew my, or like remind myself. But okay, so purple is, used to be reserved only for royalty to wear. Uh, I learned about that in my interior design when I was in college, so, because we learned like color theory and all that. So purple used to be only reserved for the royalty. Okay, so to me, again, it's Biolage shampoo with wisteria or I'm kind of getting like lavender not really lavender I think it's more like wisteria but they doesn't even say wisteria in there it says English rain and lemon petals it's a very kind of related to a little bit like fresh cut lilacs a little like kind of in the same family with like biolage it's a florally clean scent I love it I absolutely love this it's a floral one and I just I love it Oh, I love it. It's like, a, like you're walking through the a garden of flowers. So it's beautiful. And uh, so there's that one. They all have the, okay. So the Wisteria Garden has the striped background. So does Bridgerton Study. So see how those two match the background there with the stripes, the vertical stripes. And then these two, let me grab the other one. Yes, yeah. Okay, so Queen Charlotte Tea, just like the candle, if I'm getting it correct, there's two different styles of the candles besides Diamond of the Season. And so they, you know, of course, match them to it. So I got Queen Charlotte's Tea. This is Rich Bergamot, Bold Citrus, and Black Tea Leaves. And oh my goodness, so good, so, so good. Ah, oh, I love this beautiful green packaging like this teal oh my gosh this is so pretty and the gold again I love that opulent gold the gaudy gold the more the better okay <laughs> the more the better okay oh this is so amazing like this okay this is amazing hands down amazing so so we get like this tea vibe to it it has both citrus I can smell that and it has a cleanness to it it is so good that bergamot Wow, this is something else. This would be so nice in a perfume or a cologne, Queen Charlotte's Tea. So there is that. So yeah, these two right here, Danbury Shortbread, these two match. You see that? Okay, so now there's more to show you. I've got some more fun things. Okay, so I ended up getting, yeah! I'm so excited. So I got the tea cup. We do have, this actually kind of moves a little bit. The little, you know, tea bag right here uh, is, you know, sitting inside the tea. Now, or the little tea tag, I should say. I don't know the exact name of it, but it has the bee on it. I love this beautiful Tiffany blue color with the gold filigree. It looks like it's made of porcelain. It is so beyond beautiful. This is 1995. I love that they made this. See how it's even wrapped? This part is wrapped. Usually it's like a plastic piece here. So it is very, like even down to the wrap of the, you know, the pricing and the information about it is made of this like kind of like thick cardstock material. But look at how cute that is with like the tea sitting in there. The only thing is I wish it lit up. It is a scent control. So that's fabulous, love scent controls. And everything about it is so ornate and it's totally gorgeous. I just wish it lit up so that this would light up as well. Uh, but other than that, I'm so excited to have it and look at this. Yes, T for two, honey. So I love it. I, it's just so pretty. The gold part of the bottom of the cup here, and here is the back of it. And then inside we have cr a crown, just like the matches like the candle. And it is so pretty. It is so, so pretty. Here's a closer view of it. And then down here is the T. 
yeah, it's so pretty. Okay, then I also chose this oh my gosh i am so excited i know this is selling like hotcakes this one right here the teapot i love the cameo in the front i love the pink again everything is matching so you see this like filigree type style very similar to the teacup and it is so like i mentioned so girly i love that it has this like gold lining so it looks like real uh, porcelain like it could be made of like real porcelain you know they have the gold clasp here eight dollars ninety five cents and it does say Bath and Body Works with Bridgerton in the front uh, or on this tag here and the detail even goes at the bottom of it so very ornate in itself and I <laughs> love it I almost bought two I'm like okay I love this I absolutely adore this one and this was one on my high on my wish list to get today because I was like I have to have this one the B is sold out at my location at the moment but hopefully they get more in, in the stores around me I'm not sure if Laguna Crossroads or Delta Shores around me have the bees but I know Marketplace was sold out today when I was there and I'm not sure if they're gonna when they'll be if they are gonna get more I don't know next up I did get the carriage yes I got the carriage as well this is so pretty with the you know uh blue green here um, and I love that again we have the filigree going around the base of the carriage there are some important scenes in the episodes of Bridgerton that take place in the carriage some like real important uh, scenes like uh, I don't want to give away too much but like Lady Featherington and all that so it the, the carriage is very prominent in the show so eight dollars and 95 cents and even has a little handle on the door and it's so cute it really is so precious we have a little bee on top of the tag there and I love it with the gold spokes here and again this the hand sanitizer will sit in there and I'll show you how it looks in just a moment sitting in there but yes there is that one next up I did get the also the ring one so you know now that I'm in my own house here I do, it doesn't really look lavender in the store it kind of looks lavender but we have this pear shape ring pocket back holder so pretty yes I already have it in silver in the round princess cut and the pear shape but since it's gold the last ones we had were silver had to get it because gold is my favorite of like jewelry to wear gold and then it's of course silver I like both a lot but I feel like gold complements me better for like my skin tone so I try to wear more gold but yeah this is so pretty and we have the little gold clasp again this again in the store it looked like it was lavender I can't tell here it looks like it's just like clear like a diamond like not a I don't think it has I think oh my gosh in my lighting here it looks just like a clear like it doesn't have a hue to it so I'm not sure maybe it's just my eyes but I just I don't see a hue to it anymore anyways seven dollars and 95 cents and we have the tag on there again which makes it very like feels like a like limited edition type thing because they added that all right wait there is more <laughs> so I also bought the tuxedo they're calling it a blazer on the website. So we have the Bridgerton blazer. I love this blue. This matches the Queen Charlotte's tea candle and it goes pairs so well with all of like these colors here in this collection. And I love that this suit has the buttons, a vest that's also got that like twall, you know, um, pattern on the vest which matches everything in the collection and then the lapels have these little like button detail and then the sleeves also have a button detail so a lot of little detail in this little coat I mean <laughs> it's just so cute and this was or is eight dollars and 95 cents and then we have again the Bridgerton little um, thing I know I keep showing that but it's so cute they added that it makes this feel so limited I know I keep saying that too but as you can see, I'm very excited about this collection. So I'll show you in a moment again what that looks like holding a hand sanitizer because we are about to get into that. But before I do that, I also have these. These were $3.95. So I chose the Bridgerton Study Wallflower Refill. I like that they made the formula in there blue to match the packaging. And it's just, everything is just beautiful it is so beautiful so this was $7.95 but again I think they came to like two dollars and some change with my discount being 25% off and additional 
on, on top of the sale being $3.95. So next up, I did get, I'll go over that in just a moment. <laughs> There's another scent besides Bridgerton in here. I also chose Queen Charlotte's Tea. Yes, Queen Charlotte's Tea right here. Look at how beautiful the, the blue is. Isn't that so pretty that it matches the front of the tag? Yeah, and it smells so good. I can't wait for my house to smell like Queen Charlotte's Tea. <laughs> I just cannot wait. Then I also bought the Wisteria Garden because this is also a very beautiful scent. Again, we have the purple... And I mean, they checked off all the boxes when it came to details on this collection. I mean, they really checked off all the boxes, okay? Like, I have to say that. <laughs> so anyways, no details spared. Okay, then I also chose the Danbury Shortbread. So again, look at this, how nice this looks together. And then... I also bought the Dressed in White, Dressed in White Wallflower Refill because I love this scent. And the scent notes are gonna be, I did I did show that in my store walkthrough. It's so good, this is one is so, so good. So we have, let's see if I can get this open here <laughs> with my gloves on. Okay, we have Pear Blossom, Ivory Gardenia, and Satin Woods. Oh my goodness gracious, this one is a beautiful scent, beautiful. And then I also picked up a lot of hand sanitizers. I got Bridgerton Study right here, Bridgerton Study. And I'm also gonna show you what it looks like inside the jacket, like the men's Look at this. Oh my gosh, that looks so perfect in there. Look at how nice that sits in there. I mean, really, really nice. So I got Bridgerton Study because I love the scent. Then I also got Dressed in White because I'm loving this scent. So I actually have a free little must-have mini to get with a 20% off coupon attached to it. So I'm going to use that soon and I'm going to get some Dressed in White in the must-have mini because I love this one. It's so nice. Then I also got Danbury Shortbread in the hand sanitizer as well. And let me go ahead and put Danbury Shortbread in the carriage, the Bridgerton carriage. And let's see how far it sits in there. Oh yeah, that sits in there real nice. So it goes way inside so you don't really, it's not, you know, hanging out too much. Very nice. So yeah, you can see this is the part that opens up. And you get kind of a little sneak peek in the window right there of the carriage. That's super, super fun. Then I also got iced lemon pound cake because, again, my, my next door walkthrough you'll see is going to be me showing all of the rest of this collection, like the new stuff that launched when I was on vacation. But I love iced lemon pound cake, so I had to have one of those. Then I also got the Bridgerton Study again. And so that's two of the Bridgerton Study. And then I also got another, I think I got two of the Queen Charlotte's Tea. It looks like I got two of the Queen, yeah, two, did I get two of the Queen Charlotte's Tea? Did I? Or maybe just one. I got one of the Queen Charlotte's Tea. Um, and then another was Syria Garden. And another Danbury Shortbread. Oh, I did get another Queen Charlotte's Tea. Yay, I'm so happy. Another Queen Charlotte's Tea. So there is that. I also did get some ribbons. Look at how beautiful like this would be as like a gift, like putting this around. I mean, th this even matches the collection. Okay, look at how beautiful that is. So I love it. In fact, when we were on vacation, <laughs> this is how much I love Bath and Body Works. So the our suitcases, I actually had extra ribbons. I put them on our suitcases that were under the plane. So when they came through the conveyor belt, I was like, that's mine. That's mine. I knew it was mine because of these ribbons. So these are beautiful, beautiful ribbons. And I, I think they look so cute with the Bridgerton collection. Like, look at how nice the color palette, it matches the Queen Charlotte's tea. So yeah, this is just so pretty. Okay, now I also want to show you, I did get the Dressed in White Shower Gel. I love this. I told you friends, I love this scent. Now I did have a freebie, so this one was completely free, 
I just adore it. I love that, you know, something borrowed, something blue, that they made this in blue for good luck. You know, on the day of your wedding, you're supposed to wear something blue traditionally. Um, and let me tell you, friends, oh my gosh, I love it so much. It is such a beautiful, clean scent. Oh, I love it. Again, I, I want to get this in the perfume. I want to get this in the perfume. So there's a closer view of it. And then here is the back of it. And again, I'm going to be getting more of the dressed in white in the collection as well. Like when we have like a body care sale. Oh yeah. And I don't think there's a lotion in the dress in white or first sight. I don't think there's a lotion, just the body cream. Um, so there is all that. Now let me go ahead and show you or tell you how much everything came to. So we have, you guys look at my receipt. Look, my receipt is so long. Okay. So this was, let me go run down prices here. The tray actually came out to $26.21. This vanity was $26.21 after my discount of 25% off. The soaps were all $4.05 each. The um, uh, wallflower refills were $2.97. The hand sanitizers were a dollar twenty. The what else do we have going on here? A dollar twenty for all the hand sanitizers. Six dollars and seventy one cents for the carriage. And also the blazer. It even says it's calling it a blazer on the receipt. Six dollars and seventy one cents. And this one's called the hard case champagne. $5.96. Oh, by the way, let me put a hand sanitizer in there and show you. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Look at this. Oh my gosh, I love that. Okay, so then the teapot, the figural teapot right here. Where'd you go? I'm like, you should see my desk. I've got stuff all over it. Okay, the teapot right here. Let me also put a hand sanitizer in there. Let's put in the Wisteria Garden. And I'll show you how it sits in there. Okay, look at that. Very nice. So that one was $6.72. And then this here, the teacup wallflower plug was $14.96. And the dress in white was free because I had a coupon. So I saved $95.56 with tax in California. It says California tax because I'm in California, if you're new to my channel, my total came to $123.04. So that is everything I picked up for the Bridgerton collection so far. Oh, let me show you too. I wanna to show you how this sits in here. So I wanna show you, this is so lovely how everything looks displayed on this. I mean, okay, let me add, I don't know. I don't really have, you know, any, well, let me put the soap in there and show you the soap. Isn't that so cute? Oh my gosh. So, I mean, even they had it on display in the store like this, like with the teapot in there. I mean, oopsies. How cute is that, right? Like so super cute. Anyways, so that concludes my haul. Thank you so much for being here. Lady Sarah is running a little late to the Bridgerton ball yet again. <laughs> so I'll be fashionably late, but that's okay. Anyways, thank you so much for being here, friends. I really appreciate it. And Lady Sarah will see you very soon with another store walkthrough haul or both. So till next time, take care and God bless you always. I'll see you soon. Bye for now. See you soon, friends. Bye.